Up next on ESPN, as the song goes, the weather outside is frightful. Not snow, but the rain coming down in buckets out of the stadium. We'll see how much this affects both teams' passing games. My guess, a lot. Seattle, Oakland, now! While the teams are out on the field getting loose, the fans are filing in and finding their seats for the game. Hi there, I'm Dan Stevens, and welcome to the Oakland Coliseum. Peter O'Keefe is next to me in the booth, and Peter, we've got a couple of offensive powerhouses down on the field. No doubt about it, Dan, we could be in for a high-scoring game today. Number 12, he's a pocket-passing quarterback. His mobility isn't that great. He's in the pocket, and uses a strong arm to stretch the field. He's not the only big-time player on that squad. Number 87 is one of the premier receiving tight ends in the league. He's built like a rock, but his soft hands make him a great receiver. A talented duo to be certain. He just might make a difference out there. Number 83 decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackled at the 18. We have some rough weather to deal with today. And Susie Culber is down in the midst of it with a report. Susie? Thanks, Dan. It doesn't rain much harder than this, Dan. This deluge is turning the grass into mud and the is turning it right up. This game looks like it could become half football, half mud wrestling. Dan? 28. The Raiders are going to try and capitalize on the interception. They'll start this drive at the 28-yard line. Davis will take the handoff and heads out right. And we'll at the 25. Number 32 with the attack. Second down with a Second split back to Ball <laughs> Number seven oh, gets the sack way the back sack. at the 32. Number 70 sends this offense back pedaling with a nice sack in the backfield. They lose some yardage there, Peter. It has to feel like they're going down and up escalate. Yeah, a good rule of thumb here is to try to move the ball in the general direction of the other team's end zone. That, that's what usually works. They force that one backwards, and that's going to make this third down that much harder. Yeah, they also make it easier on themselves by wiping out all of the potential short yardage plays they might face. There's a long. Number 12, throws a hand, and the first on third and long. Number 12, gets this one past the secondary quite easily. I think the safeties were out of position on that one, Dan. Now that kind of accuracy is hard to cover, Dan. He knew where he wanted the ball to go, and that's where it went. Third and long, and What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about. down and heads wide left. He's in for the touchdown. Peter, he'll add a touchdown to the stats, and he has to be fair. 
Now the extra point, and it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Number 14, booms a beauty here. Number 84, runs out for a touchback. Number 84, downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Seahawks were intercepted last time out. We'll see what happens here. We'll start at their own 20-yard line. Smith picked up about seven, and that will bring up second down. Smith stayed with his blockers on that last one, and it paid off big time. You know, Dan, it's always good to have a wingman or two. They move the ball, and it will be second down. Second down, just second a single three. receiver on the field. Past the markers for a first down. Howard doesn't let a little first thing like double easy. coverage stop him from snagging the football. Nice second down call, and they will move the chain. On offense, it was always a plus to avoid third down altogether, just like that. First and ten. ten. Ball oh, C -C. 33 yard yard. Yard. Number 88 goes in motion. Number 10, zings it to the right side, and it falls incomplete. It looks like, uh, yeah, we've had an injury down on the field. As soon as we hear anything, we'll be sure to pass the information along to you. Second and 10. 10. All CC, 33 yard line. Falls incomplete. Howard's play snagged that one across the middle, but it doesn't happen. That would have gotten the first, but it's incomplete, and it will be third down. Third down, 10 yards to go. Number 10 gets all of his arm into this pass, and the catch is made well past the markers for a first down. Number 10 makes a risky pass here and completes it. That took guts, Dan. Check it out. Oh, a perfect pass. And it had to be accurate to get in there between the two defenders. Third and long, and they get the big play to convert. What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about, making the big plays when you need to, and you can't coach them. This one will fall incomplete. Number eight was the intended receiver. Number 10, really struggling out there today. As you can see by the numbers, it's all bad. Up to now, he's got 24 yards and one interception. Second and 10. Number 80 goes in motion. Number 10 fires this one over the middle and it's tipped incomplete. Number, Number 41 couldn't have like read that play any better if it was tattooed on the inside of his helmet. That'll give us a third down, and the defense was ready for that call. Well played, and a good job of not giving up the short pass. Third down, empty backfield. Number 61 takes him way back at the 46. It'll be fourth down. Big loss. I don't know what happened to the section. Let's have a look. You know, Dan, it's all about focus and persistence. He was not going to let that quarterback get that pass off. They pushed him back even farther. And Peter, could this fourth down get any longer? Well, theoretically, yeah, but it's plenty long enough already. Number five takes the snap and punts it away. <laughs> Stop at the 21. Number 49, return for a few there, but after that gigantic punt, it was like tearing a single page out of War and Peace. It doesn't make much of a dent. 
The Raiders had an effective first drive, and we'll see if they can keep it up. They'll start at their own 21-yard line. Jason takes it across the line of scrimmage and chews up about four on the play. Number 83 had to leave the field earlier in the game, and now Susie Kalber has a report. Susie? Thank you, Dan. Well, after talking with the team doctors, it appears that he's got a pinched nerve in his back. They're massaging it, and it's working well. Expect to see him on the field later in the game. Back to you, guys. Thanks, Susie. Second down, one man back. The lay of the game, offense. Five yard penalty. penalty. Repeat, Repeat second, second down. down. The Raiders got called for a delay of game on that one, Dan. They should have been more aware of the clock. Let's go, Raiders! Come on! Let's go! Let's go! Second, second and 11. Ball of the Raiders. 20, 20 yard line. Branch had two guys on him on that play, but still managed to make the catch. They move the ball, and that'll bring up third down. We almost got him, baby. Third and five. Ball of the range, 26 yard line. Number 12, that is an out left side, and they get the first on third and long. Well, there's not much room for error on this one. It's either a great passing completion or an interception. Let's take a look. Well, that's a great catch and a great completion. You don't see many quarterbacks throwing the double coverage like that. about three yards. Second and seven. Ball to Ray Page, 41 yards. The 42. That will bring up first down. Davis up boxes the defense here, setting up a huge play. He's got more moves than a chess tournament. Peter, you playing the chess? Well, it's more of a go fish kind of game. One to one, Peter, and his numbers are adding up. Adding up to one big number. Up to now, he's got 27 yards on four carries. Are out in front, seven to nothing. Carries it for a third time in a row and picks up a couple. Davis got some help on that one in the form of blocking, but he still couldn't make a play out of it. Not much there. It'll be second down. Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were, you know, hoping for more. On, second Dan. down, two second tight down. ends in the game. <laughs> Number 12 throws a bullet, and this one is incomplete. First on third and long. Branch plays this 
one perfectly, getting himself to the right place at the right time to make the catch. The defense should be embarrassed that they let this one get away. Yeah, Peter, they have him double covered, and they still couldn't get to the ball in time. That's what football is all about. Being the good plays you need to, and you can't coach that. Davis carries it for the sixth time and heads out right. Right down at the 19. Second and six. Ball on 19. Gains three yards, and that will bring up third down. Let's take it up and all the Third and three. Ball at 16 yards. It'll be first and goal. So I know what brought you back there and scrambled out of the pocket and threw it. Great play. Game's five on the play, and that brings up second down. Second down, and this will be the 13th play of the drive. They watch for the quarterback tight end connection right here. Number 30 gets the call on second down and gets the touchdown. There's the signal, and we're ready. Number 14 blockets this one deep. Number 84 downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Seahawks can climb back into it with a score before half here. They will start this drive at their own 20-yard line. advantage of some really good blocking there on that last run. When you get the initial surge like that, good things happen, especially in the ground game. They move the ball, and it will be second down. Davis is out to the left side and barely picks up the first down. of the game and gains about three yards.
up third down. All we can practice. Now we're going to get it this time. Now we're going to go just like it is. We're going to execute. We're going to stay strong, and we're going to get to the spots we need to. Okay, fellas. Number 12 throws a bullet to the flat and That's it's knocked away game. from the receiver Number incomplete. Was the no, the receiver. Receiver. Number, Number seven, seven with the cover. cover. Number Fourth four down in the field goal unit eight, eight, eight. is on the field. Number 15, Cole Holder. Number 14 kicks from 38 yards out and puts it straight through the uprights and good. Number 14 gets a soggy football here, but he's on target. And the kick's good. Great job in this nasty weather. Number 14 kicking on for the Ray Ray. The ref gets the signal and we're set. Number 14, booms a beauty here. Number 84, downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Seahawks stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at their own 20-yard line. Smith loses one on the play, and that brings up second down. Hendricks targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. And I'll tell you, Peter, he made a great tackle there. He brought down one of the more elusive backs in the game. Well, you're absolutely right, Dan. But if there's one guy on this defense that can stick with the ball and make the play, it was him. <laughs> Number 45 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. A nice defensive play will give him his second batted ball of the game. Yeah, great read there. Second and 10. Ball the 18 yard three. The Raiders take their first time out. Look at those numbers. That's Ball how to get it done on the ground. Down. Number 25 grabs the fastball over the middle. The Raiders will take a timeout. That's their second. The Raiders take a timeout. That's their final one. Second down, Second goal to go. Ball of the Ranch, a guy shadowing him, but still manages to make the catch. He beats 
his man Cole. It's all about staking your turf. That's his first touchdown of the day. And I think he's a guy you can count on to make those end zone catches. He sets a high standard for himself and usually meets it. Now the point after, and it's good. Gets the signal and we're set. Number 14 rockets this one deep. Number 85 downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Seahawks offense takes the field with the clock at 24. Number 80 goes in motion. Smith gets the ball and passes the line. Tackled and the clock will continue to run. Second down with the tight end right. Howard snags the dart right sideline and gets past the markers for a first down. Number 10 throws right past the coverage and into his receiver's hands. Nice throw. A well-designed play there, Peter, and they will move the chain. Great execution. And that'll do it for the first half of this one. Raiders in command of this one, 24 to nothing. And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer. All right, Dan, interesting game at the half. We'll get back to you guys in a bit. First, we welcome everybody. To our ESPN Halftime Report, I'm Chris Berman. Now we'll look at our halftime comparison. And as you can see, total yards definitely tell the story thus far. The Seahawks are certainly losing because of it. It's hard to win when you play like that. An exciting start to this one right on the first play from scrimmage. Number 32 is reading the quarterback's eyes all the way as he's able to get his hands on this one and pick it off. Raiders still in the first quarter. The Raiders inside the red zone. Number 40, get up ahead of steam, and then it was clear sailing from there. A 16-yard touchdown for the Raiders. Seahawks midway through the first. Seahawks behind by seven. Number 10, connected with his man on this one. Raiders middle of the second. Number 30, got the carry here, and he comes through. A four-yard touchdown for the Raiders. Raiders leading 14 to nothing. Number 43 was in the right place at the right time, as his interception was a possible momentum shifter. After driving 16 yards on five plays, number 14 would come on and connect on the field goal try. Connect on the field goal. Seahawks late into the second quarter, Seahawks trailing by 17. Number 72 would snuff out a drive on this one. It's a bumbo. Here he is for the recovery. Raiders creeping up on the end of the half. Number 12 would put this pass right where it needed to be. A seven yard touchdown for the Raiders. And that's where we'll leave this one. Raiders are up big in halftime, 24 to nothing. And as far as my halftime hero, well, there's really no contest. Number 21 has been unstoppable. So that does it for our halftime report. We'll send you back now to the second half of this one. Dan Stevens and Peter O'Keefe are there, gentlemen. Thanks, Boomer, and welcome back to our broadcast presented in ESPN Game Sound. Designed and developed in collaboration with Dolby, the leader in surround Number sound Raiders technology. The Raiders will get the ball first here in the second half, and they are dominating this game. Currently, they are up large, 24 to nothing. Now, let's get to the game. The 
The Raiders send their offense out on the field and will start this drive at their own 20-yard line. Number 40. And his number called on first down and picks up a couple. Number 40, powered forward with the football thanks to some initial blocking. Problem was they couldn't keep that push going for very long. Not much there. It'll be second down. Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were, you know, hoping for more. Second down for the on. Number 12, uncorks this to the left sideline, and it is not reeled in, incomplete. Number 87, ran a corner route back there, but unable to make the reception. That would have gotten the first, but it's incomplete, and it will be third down. the signal and we're ready number 14 booms a beauty here number 84 decides to take it out of the end zone tackled at the 18 well peter some interesting information up on the screen oh you bet well the turnover column has the grim news in my opinion if you want to win you have to hold on to the ball Number 84 took it out of the end zone, and while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20, so it all comes out in the wash on that play. The Seahawks are fading fast and are in need of a score. Their offense will start this vital drive at the long 18-yard line. Smith makes it for his fifth carry and will gain close to six. Number 80 didn't haul that one in, and it falls Number incomplete. Number 10 has had difficulties, to say the least. But now he's second-guessing everything he's throwing. Terrible day. So far, he's struggled to get 33 yards and two interceptions. Number 61, 
one. This is to his man in the backfield for a big loss. I don't know what happened to the protection. Let's have a look. You know, it's all about focus and persistence. He was not going to let that quarterback get that pass off. Either he's really gotten after the quarterback in this game. Oh, you can say that again. So far, he's got two tackles and two sacks. Number five takes the long snap and punts it away. Number 49, Fair catches it at the 36. The Raiders get their offense on the field and will start this drive at their 36-yard line. Davis gets the handoff and heads up field, tackled at the 44. Davis took advantage of some really good blocking there. They opened up a hole. And he's able to cross the line and get a bunch more without uh, really much resistance. And that's what the O-line gets paid for. Peter, what a nice pickup to get them into a second and short situation. Yeah, great play, and now they have a bunch of options on what to try next. Watch the dive, watch the dive. Second, second and two. two. Ball at the Ravens, 43 yard yard. Way back, way back. <laughs> Stopped at the 49. First down. Well, we were on that last play by Slam with the freedom. And he gained a few yards while he was at it. First down, tight end to the left. Number 40 gets the call on first down and heads his left. Dragged down at the 43. Number 40 played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. They move the ball, and it will be second down. Press, press, press. Second, second and four. four. Ball at 43. Down. Number 30 goes in motion. Number 40 punches this one left to center and barely picks up the first down. Four on the play. Number 28 with the attack. Second down, Second two wide outs on the field. Ball, Ball 35. 35. Number 30 goes in motion. Arrows off his left guard and chews up about four on the play. third down and heads out right tackled at the 22 first down davis lowered his shoulder to make the play here that's how you break through a tackle baby peter they did what they needed to do and they sweep it past the first down line yeah, he knew what he needed to do and he done did it Goes in motion. 
Number 40 has his number called on first down and rambles for about five. Number 32 with the Second and four. Ball 17. Ball 17. Ball 17. Ball 17. Ball 17. on second down and chews up about four on the play. Number 28 made the save, dropping the ball carrier before he could get to the markers. He's got seven tackles so far. Second down, and this is the 12th play of the drive. Number 40 picks up about two, and that brings up third down. Wow, look at those tackles. That's how you play sideline to sideline. It's all screaming, pass to the end zone. Great quarterback, plus their money receivers right here. Number 40 has his number called on third down and gets in for the score. This is a nice run. It's all the yards he needs. Not a huge quantity of yardage, but definitely some quality yardage, Peter. Absolutely. Great play. Another trip to the end zone, and his numbers are starting to add up. You bet, man. So far, he's got 51 yards and two touchdowns. Now the extra point, and it's good. Number 14, kicking, kicking off for the Raiders. Raiders. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Number 14, kicks this one away. Number 83, fields the kickoff at the five. Locked down at the 29. Number 83 was able to find some weak spots in the defense. Got a good run back off that kick. The Seahawks offense comes out and they are way down late in the game. They'll need some magic as they start this drive at their own 29-yard line. A bunch of receivers out there. Defense is expecting that and it's not gonna make it. Number 83 pulls it in right side and that's good for a gain of five. Number 10 fires this one over the middle and it's incomplete. Number 80 was the end of the receiver. Number 10 has found limited success in the passing game so far, Dan, and he just can't seem to get into a rhythm out there. I'd say he's not very pleased with his performance. So far, he's got 38 yards and two interceptions. Third down and four wideouts in the game. Number 45 tips 
it away on the coverage. Incomplete. That will bring up fourth down. Number 45 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Peter, the defense stood tall and forced the incompletion, but I don't understand that call. Uh, they wouldn't have gotten much at all, even if it was complete. Fourth down either way, and in my opinion, too, a bad call. Number 10 zings it to the right side, and it falls incomplete. They will turn the ball over on down. Number 32 with the Coco. <sighs> Number 80 was out on the outside, but he didn't quite have a position to make the catch. They don't get the fourth down conversion they needed, Peter, although I don't think they should have punted it away. Now that far behind, they are definitely in go for broke mode. Unfortunately, they got broke. The Raiders offense comes out and are hoping to continue their success on the ground. They will start at the 33-yard line. Number 40 gets the handoff and chews up about four on the play. Second down, Second six day. yards to go. Gets past the line and maybe picks up one on the play. Davis powered forward with the football thanks to some initial blocking. Problem was they couldn't keep that push going for very long. Peter, once he closes his grip around you, you are not going to get free regardless of how evasive you are. Not with that strength. With those guns, he could probably each other bowling balls or wide receivers for that matter. Number 40, picks up six. The Seahawks take their first time out. First down, the clock is stopped at 1.55. Takes it for his 20th carry, and he... The Seahawks will take a timeout. That's their second. Look at the numbers generated on the ground. That is impressive. Davis picks up about the Seahawks. Take a timeout. That's their final one. Third and two. Ball at the 14 yard line. Number 40 takes it for his 14th carry and heads wide left. Tackled and the clock will continue to run. It'll be first and goal. Number 40, to slam through the D on that play for a few extra yards. Hey, that's what I call a charge. Peter, they did what they needed to do, and they squeaked past the first down line. They knew what they needed to do, and he done did it. How eloquently put. Thank you. You know, Dan, that tight end is a great target in the end zone, but the halfback can blast forward for a few as well. to run. Number 36 with the tackle. Let's go Raiders! Come on! Let's get a first down! And that is going to do it for this one. The Raiders come out on top 38 to nothing. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye until next time.
All right, gang. Great work as always. And with that, we welcome everybody back to the ESPN studios for our ESPN video games postgame show. I'm Chris Berman. The Raiders stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. Let's get started in this one early in the third quarter. Number 21 makes him pay. He's running a deep route, and this ball is right where it needs to be. A 42-yard touchdown for the Raiders. The Raiders move ahead big and now lead by 31. This time at the four-yard line. Number 40 got the carry as they pounded at him on the ground, and he made the most of it. A four-yard touchdown for the Raiders. And that's where we'll leave this one. Raiders win big, 38 to nothing. Now let's check in with our player of the game, a guy who made one big time catch after another to help seal the win for his team. Number 21 is on the sidelines with Susie Culver. Susie? Thank you, Chris. You were fantastic, and you prevailed with a big victory. What put you guys over the top? Man, I think that our linebackers were the spark plugs for the whole team. Nobody wants to win more than those guys, and they put their bodies on the line every down for the good of the team. And they should get a lot of credit for this win. Chris, back to you. Get your hand off my penis!